YouTube is one of the most powerful tools that teachers have available, whether it's short informational videos to full-length lectures on almost any topic. So how can we bring these videos directly onto the ClearTouch panel very quickly and easily? Uh, a couple ways you can do this, you could either launch into an internet browser, something like Google Chrome, pull up the YouTube website and watch all your videos that way. But what if we want to bring those right into our lessons? Uh, we can do that very easily using our Snowflake software. So if I hop into Snowflake here, um, I just have the Canvas whiteboard open inside of Snowflake, and we can bring those YouTube videos directly into our lesson very simply. So if I launch into the media browser here, uh, this is just going to show me all the files that are available on my computer. You can see across the left there, um, all my folders on the computer, even things like Dropbox, Google Drive, OneDrive. We can bring all of those right in there. So if I have video files saved, I could bring those in. But we also give you direct access to YouTube across the top. So with this, this is going to show me all the YouTube videos um, that I have available. So I can just search what I want. Uh, maybe we're going to do something like outer space here. So we'll just type that in and hit enter, and that's going to find all the videos for us. Uh, once I find a video that I want, all I have to do is simply select it, and that's going to put it right into my lesson, so it's really just that easy. So now I've got this in here, I can hit play. Uh, I'm able to hear the, the video as well. We do have two built-in speakers on the clear touch panel, but I can also start to resize any of these windows. I can use my pinch to zoom, rotate it around. Uh, I can bring in multiple videos, so if I wanted to bring in another video, maybe this one here, uh, I can very quickly bring that in, resize this one as well and bring those in. Uh, I can also put multiple videos on different pages of my Canvas uh, worksheet here. So if I want to make a new page, I could bring another video here. And as I save this, it's going to remember every video on each page. So I don't have to reload and do this every time. Uh, I can save this as a Canvas, Canvas lesson as we go. So that's one way to bring the YouTube videos directly into that Snowflake software. Uh, but there's also a couple other ways as well. So if I um, hop out of full screen mode, you'll see I'm actually in a couple zones here. Uh, up here I have the media tool inside of Snowflake. Uh, this is uh, going to allow me to bring in multiple YouTube videos, almost like something like a slideshow. I can rotate between different videos, maybe a playlist that I have set up ahead of time. Uh, or I can launch right out to a browser like we talked about earlier. So now I've got the full YouTube website here. Uh, it's going to give me suggested videos afterwards uh, to be able to bring those in. But a couple of the differences, if I bring videos directly into either the media tab or right into Canvas, uh, it's also going to get rid of some of the ads in front of the YouTube videos as well. So that's something to keep in mind uh, if we don't want to waste too much time with some of those. So those are just a couple of the ways we can bring those YouTube videos right into our lessons uh, to better engage the students with that content. If you like this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up below and go ahead and click that subscribe button. If you want more in-depth training, hop over to ClearTouch Academy. We've got the link in the description below. You'll find lots of tutorials and in-depth looks at all of our software here at ClearTouch Interactive.